The Tabernacle Choir and Orchestra at Temple Square present Music and the Spoken Word. Conducting today's program are Mac Wilberg and Ryan Murphy with organist Brian Mathias and the spoken word by Lloyd Newell.
True friendship is one of the greatest blessings and deepest needs in our world today. We need each other. In fact, God wants us to need each other. He didn't send us here to be alone. This life was designed as a place where we would help and support each other, confide in, and trust each other, where we would find and be true friends. It's almost as if we were built for friendship. Friends enrich our lives, not only socially and emotionally, but also physically. The Wall Street Journal recently reported on eight decades of research from Harvard University, showing that close friendships are the most critical component of health, happiness, and longevity, more so than exercise and a good diet. Isn't that interesting? To paraphrase the Apostle Paul, true friends are kind. They don't envy one another. They seek each other's welfare. They are not easily provoked. They don't think evil of one another, and they never fail to extend loyalty and love. That may seem like an unreachable standard, but that's part of the miracle of true friends. They help each other to be better and to do better. We each have the capacity to be that kind of friend. As Ralph Waldo Emerson observed, the only way to have a friend is to be one. Being sincere and interested in others opens the door to friendship. Listening and caring, finding common ground, and being trustworthy keep the door of friendship open. Then, no matter what challenges we face, true friends walk the distance with us. As we read in Proverbs, a friend loveth at all times. The greatest example of true friendship was given to us 2,000 years ago. Shortly before his crucifixion, Jesus Christ taught his disciples Greater love hath no man than this, that a man lay down his life for his friends. Ye are my friends. We lay down our lives, in a sense, anytime we sacrifice our selfish interests to help a friend in need. We love as Jesus loved, care as he cared, and in so doing, we build treasured friendships.
This performance continues the 94th year of this historic broadcast. Please join us next time for Music and the Spoken Word. Until we meet again, may peace be with you this day and always. Till we meet.